Hello YouTube, this is an alcohol review of Buffalo Trace, Kentucky Straight Bourbon Whiskey. It is distilled in Franklin County, Kentucky. It has a fairly long explanation on the back trying to explain itself, which pretty much states that um, they're trying to capture the spirit of the pioneers who followed the buffalo. The buffalo would leave trails and pathways and whatnot. This is called the trace. So this is what they would follow going from going to the west. Here we have a small glass of it. There's a nice caramel coloring to it. It tears up fairly lightly on the side of the glass. So it is a good looking whiskey. The smell very lemony. Hints of caramel and peat. And uh, you actually can smell the alcohol burn in it. The first thing you get is lemon. Very lemony. Then you get a bit of a caramel that helps, starts to temper that down. Then you start getting that peaty taste to it. That slowly starts to build on the palate. But it comes in after you get this nice lemon caramelly flavors. The only thing I'm not a fan of is the alcohol burn. Now, many of the cheaper, lower brands, that alcohol burn is much more of a bite. It just comes in, just grabs it by the tongue, and just right there with it. This does not have that. The burn comes in evenly with the taste. So there is no bite on this. So it comes in very smooth, goes down very smooth. But as you're enjoying this lemon, caramel, peaty flavors, you feel the fire of the alcohol also fill your mouth too. A bit of a, dis of a distraction, but nothing to take any points away from on this particular whiskey. Yeah, the lemony starts to fade a little bit. The caramel and the peatiness starts to compete with each other. This is definitely a full body type of whiskey. Uh, this is something that you would have in cooler times, such as um, uh, a midwinter, such as late summer nights, uh, late spring nights, late fall nights. This is not a dessert whiskey. I would not have this with any kind of meal at all, or to uh, follow up a meal at all. This is a, I'm ending the day. It's a long, hard day of doing whatever it is that you do, and you want to put a, a capper on it to help wind yourself down, help sleep, just help relieve the stress of what you were doing. This is the type of thing that you drink. This is not a, you know, I'll just hand this off to my girlfriend or my wife. I'm sure she appreciate that. Now, this is much more, as sexist as it sounds, I know this is not terribly sexist. This is much more of a, uh, a manlier type of drink. Uh, this is not something where, oh, you know, you drink Jack Daniels, this ought to be great, I'll have one of these. You're going to find a sharp, distinct difference between Jack Daniels and those other kind of brands that are similar to it. And Buffalo Trace. Now, I'm not saying this is the top tier, but you will notice a distinct difference. This is definitely, we just simply have one glass, you sip it down with some ice on it, and it's simply to cap off any day. Where Jack Daniels is, eh, let's go get hammered, let's go party, let's have a good time. This is not that.
is definitely worth trying when you are just simply ending the evening. So there you go. This is Buffalo Trace, Kentucky Straight Bourbon Whiskey. Definitely give this a try. It's worth having it in your um, rotation of whiskeys that you may sip out throughout the month. Uh, like I said, it's not a, a cutting whiskey at all. You do not mix uh, your favorite cola with this at all. It is definitely straight the way you want it. A little bit of ice will help things, help cut down some of that burn. But it is a definite capper to an end of a long and hard day. So write any, any comments you have down below about this particular product. Or better yet, like I recommended, give this product a try. Uh, make a video of yourself trying this. Let the rest of us in the YouTube community know your thoughts on Buffalo Trace. And until next time, this, this is a good one. Until next time, keep on drinking.